Hey guys, um, Old Man Gamer Dad here. Um, I'm just going to do a tutorial here. Um, so many people have asked me in my community and everything on how to do a tab system. What is a tab system? A tab system is where I watch a lot of streamers myself. Um, and I can't always be in their stream 100% of the time, but I do go in and say, hi, I'm active in all streams. But uh, a lot of times when you put lurk, you're really not lurking, right? I mean, you're, you're going around the uh, other websites and stuff, close out of it, whatever. Um, so I'm going to show you an easy way on how to tab people lurk. And it still counts for the streamer as a viewer, still counts for you being there so you can collect your points if you need to. Also, the most important part is the love and support. I'm not saying to do this all the time because that doesn't make sense. What makes sense is that you're active in their chat, right? Um, we'd prefer that you're active than just sitting there. But I'm going to quickly show you how that works. So the purpose of this video, I'm going to be using Microsoft Edge. Um, so for Microsoft Edge, I like it because I only use Microsoft Edge for my tab systems. Um, everything else I use Opera. But with all this stuff, you'll see that I have a um, folder right here that's called tab support. So what's nice about the tab support is all I do is um, if I want to open it, you don't want to just click it because then you're going to show everybody that's in the list. Then you have to do it individually, right? But if you right click that folder and what's in very important is you do it just like this. Open all 26 in new tab group. Okay. It's asking me because I got so many. Hit yes. You can choose a color. We'll choose red for the video. Um, so now you'll see that there's everybody here that I tab, right? Now, because I have so many, it looks cluttered, but you can actually just hover over it and it will tell you who you have tabbed, you know, um, and each stream is running, even if they're live. And what's nice about this is you don't hear any music talking or anything from these tabs unless you go in the tab. Okay. Cause right now I'm actually lurking. Okay. But if I go into the tab and they were actually streaming, now there would be sound, right? And what's important is you don't want to mute it here and you don't want to mute the stream cause then it doesn't count. But with Microsoft Edge, you have the option here where there's a speaker up here and you can mute it from that section. And because of all the clutter, you can actually keep it by just left clicking the tab that you created in mine. It's tab support. If I left click it and it has it as one tab, not multiple. So it's not cluttered, you know, way my um, stuff. So I can just keep having tabs, right? So I'm going to go ahead and to close this out, I'm going to right click and I'm going to say close group. Now I have nobody open, right? So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to do this um, on uh, Microsoft Edge. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here and um, I'm going to click this little star with the three slashes. I don't know what you want to call that, <laughs> but um, if you do that, you're going to see an icon here to add a folder. So I'm going to put plus sign down here. It says new folder and this um, the purpose of this video. We're going to call it test tab. All right. Once you do that, it has officially created you the test tab. Now what I want to do is I want to put it on my banner up here because it's just easier that way, right? So I'm going to click this little arrow right here and then I'm going to left click and drag it over to my banner. Okay. Now, as you can see, test tab is right here, but obviously it's empty. So what are we going to do? We're going to go into Twitch. And we'll just use Nova Nova for this um, example. Use a couple people. We'll make it simple. So this is Nova, one of my favorite streamers, right? Well, I want to tab him even when I'm not in his stream or, if, you know, if I have to go away from the stream. And how you do that is you just go over here to this star with a plus and you left click it and then you'll see it says Nova. And then what folder you want this favorite to be in. So I'm going to drop this down. I'm going to put it in test tab. Hit done. He's now in that tab. All right, we'll go to Tesla fam. Speaking of Tesla fam, he has a video on this as well, actually, guys. Um, but right here is Tesla fam. So again, we're going to hit the star. Tesla fam. It remembers the last location I put stuff, which here is test tab. Hit OK. I got test tab. We'll do one more. Replays. So I'm at replays. Click the star with the plus. Test tab. Replays. Hit done. Now, what do you do, right? What do you do now? Well, that's easy. You open this up, you open up a page, and then you go over to your test tab that's on the dock right here. You right click it. And again, this is super important. Click open all three in new tab group. Change the color if you choose to do so. And now I have all three tabs officially open. And they're actually there and they're lurking, okay? Again, if they have sound, you don't wanna mute the stream. 
If you mute this, it'll say that you're not in their stream. You're not officially lurking, okay? So what's important, guys, is when you have this on, obviously so much is going on now, just mute them like that, okay? Again, if I left click test tab, it closes them all into that one tab, but they're all still open and you're still in their streams. Again, if you want to get out of it, right click it, close group. That's it. Done simple. If you guys have any questions, please ask. I'm going to make this a public video. So if you guys would be kind enough to follow me on all my socials on Twitch, Old Man Gamer Dad, TikTok, Old Man Gamer Dad, YouTube, Old Man Gamer Dad. Um, and please, when you get into the Twitch, come and join our server and Discord because it's phenomenal. So please hit that sub button, hit that like button, shoot a comment, a reply. Thank you guys so much. I hope I was able to help you.